for one and one half minutes. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and I thank the gentleman from Texas uh, for allowing me time to speak and uh, recognizing that Texas is also uh, affected, one of the states affected by this uh, bill, as well as Washington State, which is a state where I come from, and several other states. So I rise uh, to uh, support H.R. 622, the State and Local Sales Tax Deduction Fairness Act, and I'm proud to be a co-sponsor of this legislation. And uh, Madam Speaker, this bill is really about two things. It's about fairness and it's about certainty. Fairness because Washington is one of, as I said, several states without an income tax. And by allowing this deduction of state and local taxes, this legislation will put Washingtonians on the same level as those people who live in states that have an income tax. That's all. It's plain and simple. That's fairness. Uh, that's all we're asking for in this bill. A certainty because people work hard, they pay their sales taxes, and at the end of the year they want to know for sure that they can deduct their sales tax. That's all it is. Fairness and certainty. Fairness to put us on parity with the rest of the states across the country. Certainty in allowing those people in the state of Washington, Texas, and others to know that when they spend and pay their sales taxes, they can deduct those from their federal income tax at the end of the year. That's it, and I yield back.